Good morning, explorers. Good morning. It here. is freezing today. <laughs> it is a blustery day here in Florida. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, front just came through. So yeah. Um, we're at uh, Canapaha Botanical Gardens today. Um, this is a really cool place. Uh, yeah. 68 acres, a uh, mile and a half of hiking trails. Yeah, it was the largest uh, bamboo garden and I yeah. think the largest herb garden. garden. In the southeast. In the southeast. So it's pretty cool. Um, it looks like it's not open on Thursdays, but every other day it is open. Yeah. And there is a fee. So let's go, we'll find out how much that is. Yep. All right, so uh, I think we're ready to head in. I got my mittens on. It's cold <laughs> today. <laughs> cold for us Floridians. So. Yes. It's ten dollars for yep. adults. Five dollars for children five to thirteen years. And under five is free, so. Yeah. Or if you're a member. Yeah, it's free if you're a member. Yep. <laughs> Go inside. We picked up a map. The place is huge. As you can see, we're here. And you can either go left or right. Um, if you don't want a map, you can also do the QR code and get it on your phone. We did it! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Do you guys peace, receive people. peace and clarity in your minds? Yes. yes. Don't right. do labyrinths. That's the clarity. <laughs> <laughs> So if we didn't say, this place is actually located in Gainesville. And um, what's kind of neat about some of this stuff, if you look on the signs, it tells you about the plants, where they grow in the world, and just a little information about them. All paths have exits and entrance signs, so you know where you're going. If you didn't grab a map. <laughs> we are in, where are we, Gage? The Vinery. The Vinery. <laughs> This place is actually dog friendly and wheelchair friendly um, and also if you check their websites they have a lot of events throughout the year we'll put a link below so you can check for yourself so there are a few sinkholes in this area looks like this is the big one yeah this is the big one So this sinkhole looks even bigger. I think we were wrong. Walking into the center of this, this is really cool. You're just surrounded by a whole bamboo forest. Michael's gonna do an Instagram shot here. <laughs> Pretty neat setup. <laughs> and um, check out our Instagram if you wanna see how those pictures came out. Look, we found the herb garden. This is supposed to be the largest herb garden in the whole Southwest. So I read back there, this actually, it's not only the largest in the southeast of herbs, it's actually the largest of medicinal herbs. Just have a nice relaxing swing in the middle of the gardens. Yeah, and the bamboo's creaking behind you. Yep, yeah, very peaceful. Yeah.
Katana and Paha mean palm leaves and cups. Well, wow, this is the rock garden. It looks like it's more like desert type plants. I've got some cactus and then some agava, prickly uh, pear cactus. And there's a hedge cactus. It's a big cactus. Give it a hug. Behind me is this, what they call the wedding oak. Apparently, maybe you can get married here. With any lake, beware with alligators. Well, I don't think you can go back here. I think you have to go that other way. At the age of the dinosaurs, about 300 million years ago, there was a cicade, I think, if I'm pronouncing that correctly. It's a palm like uh, plant, but these things are pretty neat looking. This is actually called a sago palm, but it is part of the cicada family or uh, yeah. those type of palms. So all of these palms that are in this area, I guess were around about the time of the dinosaurs. Well, we put in our mile. We're back at the exit. Yep. Let's that. get out. We are on to the water. Yeah. This is the children's garden. This little guy looks almost like David the Gnome. Hey, you know what kind of fish those are? What? Koi fish. You're gonna koi with me. <laughs> Okay, explorers, I think that's gonna sum up this video. Yep, um, so we're looking on the map. They recommend that you actually come from June to September if you wanna see the best colors. The vibrant colors, yeah. yeah. We're here in January, so everything's kind of cold and dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, but a lot of times, we, you know, as you know, we do our uh, summer activities by around water and springs yeah. and everything, so. So this is a good activity. Um, takes kids, it's uh, a mile and a half hike, nice little picnic areas. Yep. If you have little ones, they have playgrounds. Dozens of gardens. Yeah, really fun. And you're out in nature, you're not catching COVID. And, <laughs> yeah. and I actually, I love that bamboo forest. Because oh yeah. uh, that, that's the first time I've actually, I think I've ever been enclosed in, in a bamboo area. Yeah, and this is supposed to have the largest in Florida of bamboo uh -huh. and the largest uh, herb garden in Southeast. So if you're new to the channel and you want to come along with us, hit that like, or hit the subscribe button below. If you like this video, and hit that like button. Or leave a comment below about your experience here or any experiences at the yeah, garden. Yeah, any other botanical gardens, because we actually really like these things. They're yeah, peaceful. It's very peaceful to walk Yeah, around. it's a nice meditative day and we breathe fresh air. It's fun. Yep. So. Keep exploring. Yep. And we'll see you on the next one.